I wanted to compare Deep Floyd IF text to image AI versus Mid Journey uh, text to image AI. So, what I did was I searched for images uh, which have been generated using Mid Journey with prompts. For example, this is an image which was generated using Mid Journey. And the prompt over here is space suit with boots, futuristic character design, cinematic lighting, epic fantasy, hyper realistic detail 8K. And this was the image which has been generated using Mid Journey V3 model. Okay. Now, with the same prompt for Deep Floyd IF, we have this hugging face spaces. We can put this prompt over here and generate an image. And this is the image which has been generated over here. Right. Uh, I found Mid Journey's image to be better over here compared to Deep Floyd IF. Okay. This could be the limitations of this model being deployed in a certain fashion over here in this hugging face spaces. Right. And with respect to, uh, you know, generative AI, you will not get the same image, even if the prompt is same, right? But then you can compare, okay? This is just a small comparison. This is not an exhaustive comparison, okay? Let's look at another mid-journey uh, prompt over here and an image. So the prompt over here is portrait photo of an Asia old warrior chief, tribal panther makeup, blue on red, side profile, looking away, serious size, 50mm portrait photography. Okay, hard rim lighting photography beta. Uh, this, these are parameters, okay, up to this point is your uh, prompt. And this is from mid journey, right? This is the image which has been generated, beautiful image. Now, this is the image which has been generated from Deep Floyd IF. I also like this image, right? Uh, so, yeah. Here I find both the images are quite good. Okay. One more prompt over here, photo of an 8K ultra realistic archangel with six wings, full body, intricate purple, blue neon armor. Okay, so on, right? This is the image which has been generated over here. Exact prompt in your uh, Deep Floyd IF, this is the image which has been generated over here. Uh, I find mid journey better over here. Okay, I find this image much more better. Another example of a mid journey prompt which says aerial view of a giant fish tank shaped like a tower in the middle of New York City, 8K octane render photorealistic. Okay, uh, so this is the image which has been generated over here. Same on Deep Floyd IF. Uh, now, this is the image which has been generated. Okay, somehow over here. Uh, I find the image of mid journey again better. So this has got to do maybe with fine tuning of or say some parameters tuning over here with respect to deep Floyd IF. Okay. Um, yeah. So these were some examples, right? So let us look at some more examples. So I wanted to look at, you know, an abstract photo of a red Ferrari car driving through a sea of Legos. If you look at mid journey, I have not used the official apps. I have just searched through the web for prompts and images. Okay, uh, and, and for your uh, Deep Floyd, I'm using the uh, Deep Floyd IF hugging face space. Okay, so here an abstract photo of a red Ferrari car driving through a sea of Legos. Now these were some of the images generated from Mid Journey. And this was an image which was generated from Deep Floyd IF. I kind of like this image over here, right? So one more image for a prompt over here, a minimalistic black and white shot of an Apple logo placed in the middle of a massive uh, Lego city. Okay. So this was the kind of image which was generated over here from Deep Floyd IF. And if I were to look at the similar prompt over here, you know, these were the images which were generated from Mid Journey. Right. Uh, one more prompt was this, a dreamy and a fantastical photo of a unicorn riding a hoverboard with the backdrop of famous Golden Gate Bridge in San Francisco. These were some of the images which were generated during, uh, you know, using Mid Journey. And the image which was generated over here is this. I kind of like this image as well, right? Even though maybe the features are not proper over here, right? But yeah, this image also is okay, right? So you can actually compare for yourself which images are better, whether it's Mid Journey or Deep Floyd IF. I think a lot of uh, these things are subjective because uh, you know you could also get very good images from Deep Floyd IF, 
uh, you could get very good images from mid journey also right uh, but mid journey currently you know you need to pay for uh, using it right they also have a free this thing i tried it out but it was very much slower uh, otherwise you need to pay a subscription fee every month uh, deep floyd if currently this particular uh, you know space is kind of free but this also has a non commercial license over here only research only model whereas mid journey you can use it for commercial purposes as well yeah so there are pros and cons for both these models this was just a quick comparison i just wanted to see how they compare uh, not exhaustive just gives you an idea of how you know for the same prompt these models generate images in a different way i'll be putting the links to all these prompts and uh, you know the images uh, which were generated right uh, actually you need to try these uh, prompts again i cannot link them in but you can compare them okay but i'll be putting the link to these mid journey prompts uh, so you can um, this website as well so you can try it out in deep floyd i have space to see what kind of images are getting generated i hope you like this video if you like the video please like share subscribe to the channel see you in another video